Hello friends, greetings from Blue Lagoon. I'm always here <laughs> with tourists. As you see, Blue Lagoon is quite busy despite the volcanic eruption going just 10 kilometers away. You can't see it from here from Blue Lagoon, but I will drive closer and I'll show you how it looks uh, from close distance. But you see the, 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 the clouds, how dirty they are, just above Blue Lagoon. Yeah, the closest uh, fissure eruption, which was uh, on 22nd of August, was maybe five kilometers away at closer to Silingafat somewhere. Uh, Silingafat is that mountain. We can say behind that mountain there was eruption on 22nd of June, but now it's quite a distance, maybe 12 kilometers away, because the remaining erupting fissure is very far, rather north of, very very much north of Sunukagiver crater. And so Gulgun is absolutely safe, it's working and full of people, people enjoying it as you see. Uh, not so many people in the morning, I had only seven passengers. And the uh, restaurant is almost empty in the mornings. So how it looks. The only signs of volcanic eruptions are the dark clouds behind. So I'll be going back and I will uh, film for you the volcano a bit, how it looks. The pools around Blue Lagoon, steaming hot water, and there you see the eruption going, but you can't see it from here. Well, but in that direction, see that is Storas Kokfat, and it's right behind Storas Kokfat, in that direction where it's steaming. So it's not that close to Blue Lagoon. Does not present any danger to Blue Lagoon, unless. It erupts for a long time and lava will start going this way. Might happen, it might reach the lava walls here, but I doubt, I doubt. It's too far away. And nice weather day today, clear skies, kind of clear, unusual for Iceland. The walls around Blue Lagoon are really massive. Just to see the comparison of a human towards the wall. Like <laughs> immense, immense walls. And it's no chance that it would come so much lava to go over such a high wall. It's uh, they really made it sure that lava wouldn't harm Blue Lagoon in any way by raising the walls so much. It's unbelievable. Unless there is eruption inside of the walls, that is a different case. But what is unlikely to happen? Not unlikely, very unlikely. See, this is the lava from 13th century or something, which was spilling over all the lava. See, it was moving here at the edge of that lava. was rolling over also here. See, 13th century lava over... over... <coughs> 2000 years old lava. So it's lava over lava in Iceland, especially here on the Reykjanes Peninsula, wherever you go.
drive across the lava, which spilled it here in June last time. And, uh, there is a road across of it. But there you see a lot of uh, volcanic steam. You see that's from the eruption from the lava which is cooling down. Uh, yeah, you see. That is, that's where the eruption is going on, like in that area. And, uh, this is the closest lava got to Blue Lagoon. Uh, here, you see? It's from uh, winter. Last winter, that's a close lava god, like 500 meters away from the lagoon facilities. Very close. Yeah, this is the newest lava, like the closest to the lagoon. That's when I went over the pipes, hot water pipes, right here. If you remember, lava destroyed hot water pipes. That's what happened in winter, last winter. This is what you see when um, driving from Blue Lagoon, from the road. The eruption, you can see it uh, from the highway, Blue Lagoon, Blue Lagoon Highway. See, people are stopping their vehicles to see it. But uh, there is a, a parking lot where you can uh, really uh, stop officially, I'll show you. See, lava is steaming there, it's uh, not that far from this road actually. I think if there is a, a threat to infrastructure, it's to this road, but maybe somewhere here, I don't know. It's Blue Lagoon Road, uh, but this is the official parking lot, like people come to see the volcano on Blue Lagoon Road. On Blue Lagoon Road, you have this turn here, but you can turn it only when you are driving from Blue Lagoon because there is a fence. So you can't turn in on the way to Blue Lagoon. Only on the way from Blue Lagoon, you can turn in here and see the eruption from. It's a really good location as well. There's no doubt about that. It's very close. I think this one is the best, like, where you can park the car, like, easily accessible. And, yeah, great view. Yeah, there, I will stop and I will show you how it looks uh, from... Let's get out and film it. 